Welcome to Jesus Let's go. So today I have some friends with me. They are I'm Carlton. Ricardo. I'm Kurt. And we're gonna do a special edition of Men's Tabletop right. Mystery Question Edition. And so we have some questions here in this jar submitted by persons on Twitter and Instagram. And we're going to give our unfiltered thoughts on the questions. So First question, God Jesus. <laughs> we need to stand up for this. <laughs> Why does sexually li liberated women intimidate you? Who intimidates you? Oh. You. Oh, your answer. Oh, oh your answer. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Define liberated. Define women. sexually liberated. No. What I mean? Why, why intimidate why men? Come here, say you men or you. Oh, you no, meaning men? Oh, it's question for men. men in general. Oh, yeah. explore mean other. The, no, them does the them explore explore sex more explore. than the average woman. I'm assuming. No, it's, it's sexually liberated. I think they don't depend on a man. Oh, 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 so if you are oh, open okay. to everything outside of the monogamous one man to one woman to a woman like enough man so, so why are men intimidated by that are you i don't know about that well, so, I'm, so I'm fine i'm, I'm not intimidated, intimidated in what I'm, 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 I'm a virgin right over here I'm uh, a, oh. sometimes when is that women are more accepting um to to sex more accepting to different things in sex um men maybe Feel like well, and she come hold me then you know she want too much you know I'm assuming or that's why I'm not going to be enough or uh, maybe because men are used to be the I'm assuming that the men are used to be the aggressor not, not even the aggressor but the one that does the work both mm -hmm. of the work but I can't I can't well, answer, I can't I can't answer this question I cannot relate to I that question at all no I'm not all right so we're moving on next question let me take one in order, order, no. order. We play domino. Oh, in order. <laughs> no, because I did not do that. <laughs> oh. What a thing I'm difficult to okay. do. Okay. Well, I'm just in here. This is a sensitive topic. Why do you cat call women? You know it isn't flattering and actually scary. Or the pss. So, oh, pss. Yes. Let's cat call him. Cat call him. Yes. In France, it's illegal. Me, who will tell you that? Cat Cat calling. Calling. Oh, so like, yeah. nice girl. Yeah, you can't Sexy. do it. Can't do that. It's innate, which is something we like. Good as. Because Why is it innate? Everyone do it. No. no. You wanna do it? No. 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 Cat call, no. 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 Cat call, no. no. You know, and so baby. Do Some man no. do it. Cat call, But you said innate to all men, and, and that's an issue where many people will, will, will call all men are generalized. Dogs and generalized. Yeah, it's just but Ricky people. Me not in a random just woman, but I would have said, We know that. I'm married. Me married. <laughs> why? I don't do that. Yes, why? <laughs> not at all. I mean, in general, the average, the average yeah. Jamaican. I think it's what man. they grew up seeing, though. Call to women. Yeah, I, think, I think that's how Jamaican Maybe. men express. You know, I think that you can give a woman a compliment without harassing the lady. Psst, baby, a sexy, you know, come on, a baby. That's probably like a so new age it, thing, though. Is you it can... on her phone? Is it is that your tone harasses her, or she just doesn't like when women just don't Psst, like when women mess them? Psst, Psst, baby, a sexy, you know. Psst. Yo, girl, your body's strong enough. You know? Like your body's strong. Yeah, like yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. No, but but the, 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 the majority of them maybe you know don't like your. Good the first it's really sexual harassment. It's harassment. I don't think. In the workplace, yeah. we don't overall, condone that on life. Yeah. Overall, Ricardo. We, in the workplace, you know, I'm saying it happens in the workplace. Man, so overall, I'm saying, I work. No, no, I'm saying it's not. It happens in the workplace sometimes. Man, so overall, in, in, in his workplace. No, he never no. said he is. <laughs> he did not say he is. Yeah. 
Yeah. But, but say, uh, next question. Uh, let's address. But, no, but then we haven't addressed the, the, the question. What was what? She, what? Said, she said that um, if we know that it's, it is scary. I know that. Yeah. That's why yeah. I don't do it. And I, Especially in this type of yeah. time yeah. when persons are being abused, raped, respect, all that stuff. You know, it, it kind of, yeah. respect. You wish me stand with I you women. Me yeah, stand. Yeah. With you when we stand, women, <laughs> we're standing matter. with you. Black, women, women lives matter. matter. <laughs> <laughs> women lives matter. Let me move Next on. I hope this is a question. Well, Meg, where is not as hard as the first question? First oh, why do you feel threatened? Oh, why do men feel threatened when they see men of different sexuality manning their own business? So well, why do really men feel threatened? Sexuality, yes, if a straight man see a homosexual. Why them feel threatened? Well, as a straight man, if I see somebody who is not um, into um, man and woman um, kind of thing, well, me not even know, because me never catch them from nobody. So I, I don't like to, to, to make an assumption based upon maybe things that you'd have seen. But if I go about them business, me go about my business. Like, you yeah, mind your business. You mind my you business, mind your business. You mind your business. But what the wise straight men I think the word threat is what's throwing me off. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Where are them questions no, no, there? Where are these questions that come from? But it's a general concern of everyday people. people. Yeah, yeah so, so, but I don't think um, um, it's still that case where the word is threatened. Yeah, yeah. The wording isn't. I don't agree with the word. What word they should have used? Where are they? Bother. 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 Maybe them thinking I'm going to look there. So them just here, I'm going to stay far and I'm coming to you. That kind of thing, so maybe that's Oh, something. like a defense mechanism to just keep them away. Keep them off from now. Nobody come, nobody come right. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I'm a true, human. honestly. You know what? I'm mean, not say it. Next question. Alright, so my question. <laughs> this oh, is oh, needed? Start oh. now. You sure this is needed? When you go to the toilet. Oh, Curry, your question. Your question. <laughs> I don't know why two things are that They could have blocked the guy. They could have blocked the guy. In the family. In the family. Pull him down. Pull him down. Why do you think it is fine to hurt women and want forgiveness, but if you are the person hurt, that this, the language man is the right. Why do you think it is fine to hurt women and want forgiveness, but if one person hurts you on a shut down. We hurt a woman, but when them hurt you, you hurt you. Yeah, you oh no, when well, I think it's fine to hurt a woman, I want forgiveness. But when they hurt, hurt you, you're yes. shut down. Shut down. It's, it's never okay. It's never okay. It's never fine. It's never okay. It's never fine. A woman, in any way. Yeah. yeah. I, I just I, think I, by nature of how we're cultured, public we never use women hurting us that much. Back then, it was always the men doing the hurting. So when the rules, it's not like it's like you know, it's not used. You're not used to it, you know. So like, if a woman hurt you, it's probably not open with it. Probably yeah, so excited. Match up your men. Hello. <laughs> men. Hello. <laughs> women, I think, will forgive easier, yeah. so they are able to forgive if they are hurt. So when a man hurt a woman, they expect the woman to forgive them. I move on. But the question now is why do men think it's okay? okay. No, it's why why do they shut down after when they're hurt but want the woman to forgive them when they hurt them? So, so like if a girl hurts oh, you, you, why are you not right, why you don't about forgive her? So when the girl did hurt you. When should he hurt you? When you shut down. When you shut down. Shut down? Yeah. yeah. What that mean? Depressed. Depressed, you know. Depressed. You, know. you start crying. Depressed. You know, start drunk right. too. Never ask you. Hello? When you were in one, when you were heartbroken, why you shut down? Heartbroken by who? Just you spoke about this in a something. I can't recall. In an unbox. We did talk about the experience. In where? Unbox. What is this? Remember this? No, but okay. it was out there, so you spoke about it. I so was a... Did you shut down? Why you shut down? No, but the thing is, the thing about me is, I down? don't expect man, sorry, to readily Very forgive cool. me. If okay. she wants a grieving time, she wants a grieving time. Mm -hmm. So I'm not expect so because I say, I'm sorry, I'm gonna jump on forgiveness in time. Alright, for me, I don't think number one, I don't think it's fine to hurt a woman. And um if it is that I'm in a relationship and I end up hurting somebody, uh <coughs> I don't I don't if <coughs> yeah, if I don't I don't expect forgiveness because if that person hurt me based on how I am thinking. I'm not going to forgive her. 
So I'm going to expect the same uh, treatment. Like Christian, you need to forgive. Yeah, but he's going to forgive. But I'm not going to go back. 5%. <laughs> <laughs> what about right? you say? Um, as for me, I don't shut down or shut out people. If you hurt if you? I reach in, in that situation. I won't shut down or shut out people. I'm going to try to heal, find somewhere for you because you can't remain um, in that position of depression because depression come like Jesus. So I don't think it is fine to hurt a woman, any woman at all. I have sisters. I grew up in a very abusive home so I know what it is like to be hurt. So I really don't believe in hurting women at all. Women should be respected in whatever they do and say. As it relates to being hurt, I mean, sometimes I don't really shut down, but I try to give myself some time to process what has happened. So maybe women view that as being shut down, but we just need a little space before we tackle the problem. But I think um, shut down, it means that and say, you know what, I don't love no more girl. I hate this. I just be it. No, so not trust no more. No, more. no, 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 no it's not oh, trust no more. Oh, you're not trust them again. Yeah, 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 I've heard, heard it before. Yeah, yeah. Change no, wallet for money. You're not trust them again. No, girl, it's time. No, 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 You hurt me. Move on. I don't want to use your hurt to judge somebody else. Start that fresh. Jesus again. Y'all want to tell the million man there. Start that fresh. We don't have a trust this year, dog. Okay. I didn't have that, but... Okay. Next question. Why is it so hard to communicate as men? I, I, I don't think that's a fair question. No, no, communicate no. how? How you mean? No, I didn't talk openly. What should mean? Why is it I so hard to communicate? I think express yourself openly. I think like should... Instead of. You know, when some. I can't really. I can't really. Because I don't have bad comments. Men really I'm working on things differently. I men just don't believe in that. I, I believe in communicating ones. after a while. So when something happens, I'm not going to speak the same thing. I want to process yeah. it because my mouth is probably not the, the, so the gentlest when I'm speaking sometimes and I'm hurt. Oh. I want to take some time to process that that what I'm saying is said out of a good place. Okay. So, and then something, I just feel like some things I just need to keep. I to everything. But, but it everything. communicate, I'm referring, to, I'm assuming maybe in a relationship, yeah, when they have a in problem. the form of relationship, maybe not in problem because it never means a problem. Well, like, well, it's in general, communicating in general. overall oh. and women expect a certain um, type of communication, a, response. Okay. a certain kind of response, men expect a different kind, so just for your woman to understand your mode of communication, how you communicate, yeah. and then you can come to a common ground. Because some women like to talk right off the bat. Mm -hmm. Some men, as you mentioned, like to hold it back a, a little. Mm -hmm. And if you understand how I relate and vice versa, it shouldn't be a case where you think we don't know how to communicate. Understand each other's communication style. I mean, yeah, you can work I, yeah, you have, to, you have to know who you're with, though. You have mm -hmm. to know who you're dealing yes, with. This, and then yeah. you have to know this when. This for me is a, is a work in progress, right? <laughs> but for some reason, I've always been told that. We have a communication problem. So, I'm so sure you always need to respond. Okay. 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 For me, right, say for instance, I'm doing something important, mm -hmm. right? Like watching a football game. Important. Important. Yeah. It's very important. Yes, yeah, very important. Every All right? Saturday, every My Sunday. wife now decides that, that is the straight. moment she wants to talk about something you know, important. Understand. I'm in something watching my football. What's it's very important, important to her? Something. She comes and she starts talking to me. The only thing she'll get is, mm -hmm. yes. Right, and then further down the line, you hear when 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 that event comes up, mm -hmm. right? And she says, "Remember, I spoke to you about this." Yes, uh -huh. Me no have no recollection <laughs> of that. We are talking about, <laughs> right? And so, as a woman, young lady, you have to know when speak to her to communicate. Find the right time to speak to your man. 
after you know, do certain things. So very first time do this one like it. Passion to him them kind. You know, you know, when they make you yes. full attention. Right? That is the perfect time. It's not hard to communi communicate with men. It's just that you have to find a, a, a common place. The right ground, the right time. Right time. Alright, next question. Okay. Oh, am I? <laughs> Alright, this question says Why do men find it hard to groom themselves? They be looking crusty and dusty sometimes. But but I think that sometimes um, masculinity, no. what we have inherited, tells us that men are must be rough and tumble and crusty and that kind of but thing. Then again, and then some men just some chat about this. Trust. But I don't subscribe to it. No. You know what? This this so nice. It's coming from a <laughs> You know, the girl up the message. I'm going to go to the house. That's why. I was about to say that because look at I'm saying, if, 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 Look at the, the, the average man going to work now and going out. Them, them take, they're taking Truman pride thing, think. in themselves, you know, them trim, mm. the beard nice, them beard. If them don't beard, they put on cologne, Ricky, you know. But, but <laughs> just, <laughs> but just. Then no, no, I love you. <laughs> but I think it's, yeah, a but culture, it's a cultural thing, and men think them need to be macho and tough and crusty. But I don't know if women are like that. Women like that in a Some women. Mm -hmm. Some women want to talk to bad man. man. Ungroomed and smell bad. Ungroomed and crusty. Ungroomed. Maybe it's more masculine. Oh. No, no, I can't relate to this question. Young lady. To that. Oh. Young lady, we can't relate. We are well kept over here. Yes, sir. Yeah. Oh. Question. Whatever. What question? Disclaimer, I cannot relate to this question. Before I even read it, I cannot relate to this question. So men, this is for you. Mm -hmm. Why do you lie about who you've had sex with and the amount of times you've had sex with them? Imagine till me, Mary. Hello? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Jesus. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. I grew up very protected. <laughs> so, I don't need to lie about that. But I don't think it's men normally ego. hide. Ego I think thing. men sometimes embellish and add on and say they would have 10 and 15. When nobody goes, nobody has to Yeah, but I, I don't think them can't steal the really? number. Yeah. I think okay. women can't steal the number, but men normally put it on. Add a few yeah. here and there. They, they usually say if women say they sleep with 5 persons, add 5 to it. Yeah. And if men say they sleep with, with 10, yeah, subtract right. 5 from it. That's what we normally hear. I really so, cannot comment on this. I don't think though. men. Hide the number it's, a, it's, a, it's an ego, it's, it's an on, ego on, thing on, because everybody, when you're around your friends and they must say, Yo, mash up the girl there and mash up about 10 girls, you know, you want to fit in, so you're gonna say, Yeah, me do 15. <laughs> so it's, a, it's an ego, it's an ego thing. You want to look cool, you, know? okay. you want to look cool around your friends, but I, yeah, for some men, men don't need for life. I'm saying, a tree or two girls, girls, ladies. Women, yeah. no, girl, woman, my wife, <laughs> only, and my wife. No, they've never asked you. They've never asked you. Look at this one. This is being honest. Being honest. Being honest. Being honest. And we are honest, yeah, upstanding so. men over no, here. No. We don't lie. No, men. Why do men wear chapstick? Why do? Yeah. Um, I don't wear chapstick. For me, I used to wear it when I was dehydrated. My lips were very dry. When you were? Yeah, but I wasn't drinking enough water, so I had to compensate so for the water by using chapstick. Um, but no, my, look at my skin. One to it. One to it. Where I try to find it? One to it. Some chapstick for your skin. For your skin. <laughs> um, no. I, I I drink water, I, make, I ensure that I drink a lot of water so my, my, my skin is dry or anything like that. So I don't use chapstick, no. But men wear chapstick to, I guess, to com compensate you know for something they lack. Compensate. If you look like nice. You put on a little chapstick on my lips. What's wrong with it? Chapstick, look at these lips. 
Come on, one kiss. Cross to it, man. In a 2020, I don't think so. But, but, <laughs> but, 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 you have some persons who, for different reasons, probably them sign us his drive, them live for them. Have, and then, of his too cool, of his name too cool. Yeah, and the sun hot, hot chopstick you know, yeah, offer you this protection. I mean, you don't want your lip for it. It's, it's not that they wear lipstick for the cute. I mean, it, it is painful when you have a cracked lip. Yeah, 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 trust me, it's hard to pre pre prevent it's that. Food. I drink water. It's not around with that. My, my wife buy them regular for me. My wife take care of you. No, ask my next question. Hello. <laughs> Why do men only have one pillow? Oh, what? 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 If we can find some positive in this, right? If I share a pillow, you have one pillow, so when she come over, two of them edge. Sharing. Sharing pillows. Sharing pillows. Pillow, so ah. Very, very close. close. Okay. I mean, outside of that. Is that the case, girl? If you're watching, you comment pillow. below. Let's just follow her. I'm not clear. 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 I'm not Please find your MP and ask for a pillow the next time they give you up. Michelle, man, pillow. Monica, man, pillow. Woo! Pillow said Okay, so my... My question is... I want to see more lists. I want to see more lists. So my question is, are you okay if your future... Hey, are you a Michael Sandis? Yeah, 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 go ahead. Take Warranta. it. No, we know another one. Finish the question. Finish the question. Oh, are you Cameraman, ready? please come this way. Are you out of this now? Are you okay if your future wife can't cook? If not, why? Yeah, really? Why does it look like you can't cook? Who that? Who that? Hello, hello? Hello, hello? Hello, hello? Hello, hello? Hello, hello? Hello, hello? What? What? Hello? <laughs> um, I mean, no, cause I am. I think my mental space is skewed because I grew up seeing my mother always doing that as a wife, taking care of the house. So naturally, I'll have an ex expectation of my wife to cook for me. Not saying that she has to cook all the time, because you know, when I chef, check my videos, my bakers, chefies. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, um, I would not have. So what, what, I would. <laughs> You know your bakers, bro. Bakers, I can't do that. I'm not going to be on that. Ladies, it is important. I'm still answering. Right? I'm still answering. So what I was saying is, before I was interrupted by these people. <laughs> I wouldn't be upset because you can learn to cook and maybe that's something that we can probably do as a couple when we're married glory you know to you know cook to cook and eat in the kitchen who can eat oh that's when the food go down my throat eat yeah man eat eat what hurts us now what hurts us now guys sometimes <laughs> I mean, it's I mean new sometimes, sometimes they are quite a woman you don't know if them can cook. You might start to catch feelings before you even taste one egg. So <laughs> in that case, what do you do? Move on? No, you continue to enjoy and see how where the relationship go. I mean, girls can learn to cook. They, yeah, ladies, they ladies can learn to cook. Will, yeah. if, they're, if they're interested in the marriage, they might probably learn to learn, cook. If yeah. you can cook, just teach them but it's you women, can learn if you are what is an hour learn to cook your it's a different story like, you know, no but you have girl. women in, in no, 21st century you now know, who think it is okay if they don't cook they have a helper well come on cook but and you have to be a cook for your man every night no but you have women okay. who take on that culture now and i don't think um as men we need to say all right then it is your job to your most cook you have women who are professional women that. who think it's okay for have a helper with them can pay for I, I, no, but, but and even, then the other thing, no, maybe even, they have yeah, other strengths. No, but even when they watch so. movies and stuff, you always have that one night where they probably want to try to cook a one meal for them or something. So what I think what he's saying is, we're not saying African cook. 
to get married. But it would be nice you if you learn, can learn you to, you know, learn to learn if a book could want some water, like a special dish or something, boil some water. So one man might have a woman cook. And if the house don't fix it, we can't fix it. Also, we're not going to have a plumber. Yeah, and yeah, I'm not alone. No, we can't cook. No, we can't cook. No, we can't cook. No, we can't cook. But I don't think it needs to be a way where you say it's a mosa. Yeah, yeah, I don't think yeah, it's a deal breaker. You don't think it's a deal breaker? Women naturally want to cook for them, man. Yeah, that's a right. One show appreciation. Yeah, yeah. Women want to cook for their man. It depends on the relationship and how the man feel about that. If the man wants a wife, yeah, okay. and you would not be interested in learning to cook, it's going to be hard. Yeah. Go the kitchen to go out the water for the man. Trust me, the problem with the doctor. Okay. The next question. The last is question, guys. The last question. Why is pleasing us so difficult? Why is pleasing men so difficult? I think the easiest thing. Yeah, a man yeah. has to please. Men are so that hard. Like, you, like the more I find hard to please them, mm. that the more find a woman find hard to please them. Please them man. In what sense? So though? is it sexually? I, is it um, interpersonal? Appreciation wise? Is that general question? I don't know. Like, you men are more what simple. But what do they feel like men are hard to please? They can't buy me clothes and them something. I don't know which we don't match. Men are hard to please. Yeah. Men are more simple than women. I'm good over here yeah. with right. gifts and them. Every, every general, yeah. general, yeah. Of course, you know. But I guess other persons are different, so probably the person who asks ask that question might have okay. somebody. Yeah. Who I think it still comes down to the person you're with as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So but just, I'm a hard to please. Just get to know the person that you're with. Which is important. Get to know the man that you're there with, <laughs> and then from you know him, everything it should be yeah. should be alright. What he said. Yeah, we yeah. All right, so that was um, Men's Table Talk, the mystery question edition. But before you go, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. And thank you for making it Life Lessons with Jason. Jason. All right, so we'll go back to the game. Yeah. 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 Yeah.